58 professional fights between these two men coming in. But for Formiga, he's fought everybody. He fought Sir, six guys Sir, who ready? fought Demetrius fight. Johnson for the title. Went to a split decision with Henry Cejudo back in 2015. We'll see how it goes for Formiga tonight. He's in black. Alex Perez is in gray. We'll call it white. And Alex Perez right away with that low calf kick. Boy, that has become a staple in MMA, hasn't it? Yeah, it has. And we, we spoke about it in the back a little bit today, Joe. It's one of those weapons that if you're smart and as you're evolving with the game, you got to start using it. And you see Alex Perez throw three of them right away. Oh! Clip Figueredo. Clipped him with that left hook. And this, Miga, is, excuse me. And, and this is this guy's a wrestler, right? Everybody yeah. fought before. He was a wrestler, but I think when he fought Shorty Torres, we saw the type of stand-up ability that Alex Perez possesses. But Juicier's seen it all. You know, yes, yes. Juicier's a guy that, as you said, holds a victory over Figueredo, just fought for the title. Guy's been in there with everybody. Got a ton of experience. He's not gonna get shooken up real quick. You gotta take a guy like him out. Again, Alex with that low kick. So far, Formiga hasn't shown any limping on that left leg, but keep an eye on it. Another one. And to this point, Juicy has allowed Alex to lead all of the engagements. He's got to be the guy that goes first sometimes. Well, Alex came out of the gate so fast. He buckled under that one. Good counter left from Alex Perez. Good right to the body there yes. by Alex as well. He's got some fast hands. He's also got a 5-1 and one UFC record coming in here tonight. Two minutes have gone by here in round one. Well, you watch these guys that Co Coach Oyama trains, man, and they're all so well-skilled. They all they do everything the right way, too. They don't leave themselves open for counters. I mean, look at that pivot that Perez just threw after he missed that uppercut. Nice little left step, pivot off to the side, and keep himself out of danger. Yeah, I mean, Oyama, we were talking about a guy who's been in MMA for a long time, was Rampage's coach way back in the day. Some swelling on the right side of the face of Juicy A Formiga as Perez continues to throw offense. And again, it's just the activity right now, right? Alex Perez has just been way more active than Juicy A Formiga. Juicy A's having a hard time with that leg now. You're seeing some oh. significant swelling on that outside of that left leg, and it, he's moving funny on it now. Mm -hmm. Perfectly timed and placed left hand of the body from Formiga a moment ago. And if you remember the Benavidez fight against Formiga, a lot of kicks to the leg, really worked his way from the bottom all the way to the top in order to get the finish. Alex is showing him the hands now to set up that low kick. Obviously a big part of their strategy coming into this fight was attack that left leg. Formiga got out of the way of that one. Mm -hmm. Perez, the former Selma High School wrestling coach out there in California, D.C., had yeah. to get that out of the way. I mean, yeah, man, he, you know, he was, he was bragging about Selma the other day, but I told him that Selma time's about up for a little bit. Oh, man! Big shots by Perez. Ooh, there it is again. Oh, that there, it is. Bad. there it is. Oh, that there it is. Bad. Oh my goodness, over and Perez over. Let him up, kicks. let him up. Formiga can't put any weight on that kick, on that leg. Oh, and Perez goes right back to the well. Oh man, it is so busted up. Look at that left leg. That is a mess. Oh, oh my goodness. That's it. It's over. That's it. Ace. Wow. A knockout wow. due to calf kicks. That's incredible. <laughs> Alex Perez coming out of the gate, guns blazing with that low kick. The real low on the calf kick. Such a dangerous kick, and he checked that yeah. one, DC. <laughs> he checked that one, as we were talking about before, and it didn't help. That that chin was that shin is so busted up. Watch Here's this one, the last Joe. one. Yeah, this one's short too. It sometimes just it. Yeah, sometimes it's even worse when it's short because you get the toes. It, it I mean, that is a <laughs> terrible. I mean, that one was short. He almost got out the way. It's crazy. It just grazed him. That one just grazed him. To make this one official, we go inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Keith Peterson has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, six seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by TKO, Alex Perez!